going up to a higher level. I wonder if this is what we're going to be, where we're going to be at later on. Going over to the other side now. Okay, this is step two at the blowholes. So what they do is they pump out, uh, drill a hole, and they pour compressed swap, um, air into they pump the compressed air into the hole and the brine blows out as we saw earlier and what we're doing now is we're collecting um, unlike the muddy location this is you know the brine has washed all of the crystals out the crystals are mostly clean there's not a lot of uh, um, digging to be done you're pretty much just picking them up off of the floor and again I think some of it is hangsite, but um, there's also some halide and other things in here too. They think that it's like snow, so the kids have been throwing it at each other and playing with it. So here it is all over the floor. And it's been kind of picked over now because the crowd has been here a while, but let's take the kinds of pieces. Here's one that kind of got messed up in the process. This one is asymmetric. This is kind of cool, I'll keep this. Here, Doss, come here. Look, here's another one. Shapers. More cubic.
Behind the cones, please. Behind the cones, everybody. Mark! We're in it now. Hope it's not toxic. Be careful. Might be lost a little bit, you know. No, look, there's some big pieces just came out. Sometimes it's hard to tell if they're coming out or being pushed along. I know. <laughs> Look at that round. Yeah, to collect. 
we don't know what. <laughs> Everybody's missing a parent. I found your father. Water's going down, so we can see better now. It's a madhouse. They just finished pumping and all of these people just rushed in. But I have to say, when we got here, we were one of the first cars. And they got much better specimens than any that I see pumped up here because I think they were pumping for a while before we got here. And so that's kind of the secret, folks. Um, in this afternoon session where you go to the blowholes, you want to be one of the first cars out here because they will have primed the area for you. And then you get to simply pick up and you don't have to deal with the hordes because they're still driving. Because here, the madhouse with the circle, while they're pumping, they're doing a demo blow. And, uh, you know, they'll get some stuff out, but you really um, have a better chance if you are one of the first cars here in the afternoon. Last day at Trona, we're packing up the campsite. And oops, the wind is really high. That tent over there used to be over here somewhere. I know.